Today, we're going to be talking about a brand new reality that I think most SEOs have not really woken up to, which is the craziest tool I've found probably over the thousand tests or more than 1,000 tests I've done with AI SEO, right? So what am I talking about? I'm talking about Bolt.new. This is really, really mind-blowing when you look at it because you can basically build anything and replace anything that previously had a team of SEOs to do. There's only one exception to that, which I'll come on to later. But from what I've tested on Bolt, you can essentially, for example, just build a new website in seconds and then deploy it in one single click. And you can build your own tools and everything else, right? I'll show you some examples today. So if we go onto Bolt and we're like, right, okay, create a 300 page blog about birds answering every common FAQ that someone would be interested in. And then just as an example, you know, we could go into, then you can just grab a database, for example, and then just as a totally random example, you could grab a database from birds, for example, like from GitHub. Then we hit enter like so. By the way, this is stuff you can never do on ChatGPT. Like ChatGPT is not just going to create like a 300 word blog on the spot about birds, but you can do that directly inside Bolt. And if you like, right, create a 300 blog, 300 page blog about birds in every single common FAQ that someone will be interested in. It's like, all right, mate, just get that organized straight off the bat. You're getting all the content It's creating it as you can see, and we're ready to go in like one single prompt, as you can see, and then it will start adding the blog content, answering some FAQs. It figures out how to set up the foundation, how to categorize it here. So for example, species profiles that will have a hundred posts, but behavior that will have 50 posts, habitat and environment, 50 posts. Like this is stuff that's on a totally different level to chat GPT or Claude or anything else that I've ever seen. Bear in mind, like 12 months ago, you'd have to use an AI SEO tool. Then you'd have to link that to WordPress. You'd have to install a a bunch of plugins, a lot of the content wouldn't be very good, loads of technical problems, plus you'd have to wait hours for the content to generate with a lot of back and forth. Now you can create it in like one single prompt without even being able to code. And if you want to create the UI as well, the user interface and the design for the website, you can be like, right, create the UI for the birds website so I can navigate around it. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Imagine how much, for example, website design agencies are getting paid or SEO agencies get paid to set up a new website. Now you can just easily automate this using something like Bolt. So for example, after I ran that prompt that said, now quit the UI for the bird's website so I can navigate around it. It's done it, right? It's actually done it. And the UI looks better than anything I've created on WordPress. I'll tell you that for free. So it does the design, it does the content creation. And you can see here, it reports back to you. It says, all right, I've created a modern responsive UI for the bird blog with the navigation, components, pages, features, etc. right? So if we go onto this website, you can always customize it as much as you want. But essentially here is like, right, discover the world of birds, your comprehensive guide to understanding and appreciating our favorite friends from species, guides to care tips. We've got everything you need to know about birds. And then you've got all these posts down here. It's so easy. It's categorized here. Across the navigation bar as well, you've got it nicely organized and categorized. If you go into all posts, you can see all the posts right here. What I think you could also do is just plug in your API from OpenAI and then use that to generate more content on the go. If you come up with a name for the blog, you can easily get it to customize that. So you can ask Bolt like, right, the name of my blog is Cheaper Birds, for example, just create a blog about that, customize all the content, all the theme, etc., to that, create a nice little about me page. And it's just ridiculously easy to do all of this. If you're like, right, I need 10 blog posts on species. Okay, add 10 blog posts on bird species based on some relevant SEO keywords people would type into Google. Now, what you could also do is you could upload, for example, databases directly into Bolt and then create like a sort of programmatic SEO website as well. I'm not telling anyone to do that, but I'm saying it is possible within the realms of Bolt. The other cool thing is as well that you could customize it in a way that maybe 99% of websites can't. So, for example, if you wanted to add tools, if you wanted to add calculators inside there, all of that is possible with AI but most people will not be doing with that with the WordPress websites. Whereas if you create it with Bolt directly, you could create like all sorts of amazing bird watching tools, relevant or whatever tools you want to create relevant to your niche and actually customize it and create more value than most websites out there as well. So it's not like you're spamming the internet or creating trashy websites here. Like you could create something way, way better. I mean, this is what I've created in the space of 10 minutes. I've created a whole new birds website, customized with a nice little UI probably better than most of the websites that I've created last year. Imagine if I sat behind a laptop and did this for eight hours in one single day, like you could create something absolutely amazing. There's another cool idea that I have as well for making money 
with these websites, which I'll come on to in a second. But if we go to species here, we've got a bunch of new blog posts, as you can see. So it's created a blog about hummingbird species, introductions to birds, northern cardinal, blue jay facts, etc. Like, it was so, so easy to do this. So it's come up with like some interesting facts, habitat, etc. diet. You can always get this designed in a nicer way as well. Or if you wanted to shell out the content, let's say you want to have like 500 or 1,000 words per page, you could probably ask Bolt to do that too. And so let's look at the facts here. Number one, you can create and design websites in one single prompt without being able to code. You can create better websites than most SEO agencies will probably create for you, even if you spent thousands of dollars. And you can do that in minutes directly on Bolt. You can design websites in ways that you've never been able to, and you can get more control. You can actually get a free plan directly on Bolt. So like if you don't want to spend money on this, but you do want to use it, then you just stick to the token limit per day and you can deploy it in minutes as well. So for example, if we click on deploy over here, it's going to deploy this application. It started building out the website, as you can see. And then if you want to transfer this to an actual domain, you just click on the link right here, sign in with GitHub and get that domain claimed. Because we all know how painful it can be setting up the DNS and the hosting and everything else. Now you can do that instantly using Netify and the deployment process. So once you've signed into Netify, if you click on this, hit claim, add project to Netify dashboard. Here's a website I just created in like literally five minutes. But then we'll just click on set up a custom domain. So for example, cheaperbirds is bat.com. Hit verify like so. You add a payment method. Once you've added the payment method, now we can click on register domain for $15. And then if you go on cheaperbirds back.com, we can see the website deploy. It's too easy. It's too easy to create websites. I don't know what that means for websites. Like the value of them is totally dropped, honestly. And, you know, this is just a total sum. I'm not recommending you create a website like this. I think you need to give it a bit more value, a bit more attention, a bit more care and quality control on it. But you get the idea of how easy it is to do. And the design is way better. Like, here's an example of an old website just created on like a trashy sort of basic theme using a bunch of paid plugins. Now here's a new website we created in 10 minutes. I would say the design is a lot nicer. It's minimal, but that's what we like. And then once it starts ranking, we can always come back to the design, go into bold, get it redirect, get it redesigned, etc. right? So easy to do. I just checked if it's working in incognito, it is. So you can just build and deploy websites so quickly now. The other cool thing about this is like, Let's say, for example, you have a database of products that you want to affiliate with, say on Amazon, et cetera, then you could actually just create a whole new website, plug in your affiliate code directly to Bolt, and it could create a whole new website where you promote different products. Bolt creates all the pages, publishes them, deploys them, et cetera. And what, it's going to take you like an hour, something like that. You can create an affiliate website in an hour. Massive money-making opportunities. Like I say, you don't want to be spamming the internet. You don't want to be creating low quality trash. So make sure you do quality control before you publish. And I've, I've got loads of quality control tips inside my free SEO course, link in the comments description. But you get the idea of how powerful this is. Super exciting. And if you want to see more about this, just let me know in the comments. If you just want to start a brand new project, you can just go directly into bolt.new, back to the main page and start that bad boy right there. Now, I did mention that there's one thing I can't see bolt.new replacing just yet. And it, it might happen in time, but from what I can see, it's not going to replace, for example, the human interaction that's required in SEO sometimes, particularly with link building. So, you know, all the back and forth, all the negotiations, I think it probably could create an app for outreach, but it's not going to be able to speak to humans directly and convince them to build links or handle payments as far as I can tell. Maybe it will do one day, maybe not on this generation, etc. But you can see the power and the potential of this. Like, it's, it's really cool. So, for example, it just drafted a really quick website for me right here. If you ever have to start again on a new project or you want to build a new project, this is probably the way that I would recommend it. Now, I do think you need to be careful about security errors as well. But this is the easiest, fastest way I know to automate websites and build them out quickly. Now, some other cool things that you can do with it is you can build your own tools, deploy them as well. You could probably take like a screenshot of your actual blog and then ask bold.new to redesign it, but focus on improving conversion rates. You could also, for example, take any data that you have from Google Search Console or Ahrefs you want to analyze and then upload it to bold.new and create some interesting stuff around that. So the potential of this is just limitless. Honestly, from what I can see, this has replaced a lot of SEOs and a lot of SEO agencies already. The biggest barrier to the industry and people figuring this out 
is actually just learning how to use tools like this. But apart from that, but from what I can see, it's pretty much limitless when it comes to websites, deploying them, creating new sites, redesigning, programmatic SEO, etc. Very, very powerful tool. So thanks so much for watching. Even for like funnel building, I think it could be super powerful. So for example, if we were like create a lead magnet website, turn leads into clients, you know, we could probably do something as basic as like create a lead magnet website to turn leads into clients for my business, Goldie Agency, and it would just start working its magic and create like a squeeze page designed right there and then. Same with like e-commerce stores. And then you would just hit deploy again and you've got a domain ready to set up and start converting SEO traffic into sales in whatever niche or industry you're in. So thanks so much for watching. If you want to get free access to my 200 free ASEO strategies and video course, feel free to get that links in the comments and description. You'll learn tons of cool stuff in there. It's got hundreds of tutorials, SPs, templates, tips, workflows, tools, etc. Like you can see, should you use this squeeze page really? It looks pretty nice actually. And if you actually log in, go to the free SEO course, then go to free SEO tools and then bolt.new, you'll find some interesting tutorials and SPs that I've created to help you. Also, if you want to get a free one-to-one -one SEO strategy session that shows you how to get more leads, traffic, sales, or SEO, feel free to book. We'll give you a free SEO domination plan. You'll discover the secrets of SEO link building. We'll answer any questions that you have one-to-one -one on that call. You'll discover the best link building strategy for your website, how to quickly outrank your competitors link building, now to 10x SEO traffic based on what's working for us. Feel free to book that in. Appreciate you watching. Bye-bye.